so attracting africans in the diaspora especially african americans to come visit africa and have an amazing experience has been on the radar of several african countries but none so more than the african country ghana which has been more persistent in that effect and launched the year of return initiative in washington dc which has seen a record number of african americans and several africans in the diaspora return to africa as they heed the call to come and experience the african continent so today let's look at six reasons why african americans should endeavor to come to ghana specifically of all the equally wonderful african countries if you like content like this be sure to like and subscribe subscribe to this channel for more contents like this let's get right into it point number one the welcoming nature of Ghanaians this is the first thing any African American who has visited Ghana would bring up the hospitality of the Ghanaian people is top-notch and the most popular and widely known word amongst African Americans who have visited the motherland is Aquaba which is a Ghanaian word directly translating to welcome. The vast majority know this not just because Ghana was the country to launch the Year of Return initiative, but because anywhere you are to see yourself in Ghana, you would hear the word followed by a wonderful welcoming reception, which makes all people feel welcomed and appreciated regardless of who you are or where you come from. This welcoming trait cuts across all people in Ghana as if hospitality is imbued into the very nature of Ghanaian people and thus making African Americans who visit feel especially welcome to the continent and the country Ghana. At number 2, the peaceful nature of Ghanaians. Ghana was ranked the most peaceful country in Africa in the year 2020 and second most peaceful country in Africa in the year 2021 when the Global Peace Index released their findings which goes to show the consistency of Ghana being up there anytime the topic of peace is mentioned in Africa. Ghana is known as the motherland, which signifies the gentle nature of a mother when caring for her children. The people of Ghana are known for being calm and receptive to visitors, giving a visitor the respect and space they need to operate, whilst almost never invading in the privacy, and that's how the people of Ghana are built. The word peace is almost synonymous to Ghana because in any description of the country, if peace doesn't come up, then it's probably not the right country being discussed. And this is perfect for African Americans who are visiting for the first time and need their space and clear head to take in all the experience while also being unbothered and also free to operate. At number 3 being black or african american in ghana is a good thing now this point cuts across and applies to every african country where african americans don't feel like being black makes you targeted of sorts but ghana takes it up a notch being an african american earns you a bonus access because for some reason just the fact that you are an african american could excuse you from things done out of ignorance where in some parts of the world not even foreigners are excused for the minor things done out of ignorance in ghana you could just blend in whilst vibing with almost everyone and also getting special treatments just because you are an african american and that's so cool and makes you appreciate the people more because they appreciate you as well and as many people say respect is reciprocal and you would feel it probably in ghana more than any part of africa at number four the tourist attractions the tourist attractions in ghana are on a different stratosphere because you get to experience just about anything from slave castles which are the remains of a collapsed era to hikes canopy walks mountain climbing skydiving just name it ghana is the place to be almost every region has hidden gems that if you are an explorer you just be in great luck there is an endless possibility of fun things to do in ghana all you have to do is just have a place in mind or an activity you would like to experience and it would more times than not be available in ghana 
The recreational, cultural and historical sites in Ghana have made the country a go-to spot when, as an African-American, you think of tourist attractions in Africa. Several African-Americans who have visited have experienced the Cape Coast Castle and you probably can't be an African-American in Ghana if you haven't seen these remains of that fallen era. And if you are, then you are entreated to experience that for yourself because it's a real moving experience. At number 5, the social circles. As a visitor to a foreign land, one would yearn to have familiarity of people coming from their home countries and in Ghana, the African American community is a huge and present one. As of 2015, the number of Ghanaian residents who are African Americans were estimated to be 3,000 and more, which is a huge number of African Americans. But note, those are residents and doesn't even take into account African American visitors of whom in 2019, when close to 1 million foreign visitors were recorded in the country, African Americans made up the majority of those visitors which goes to show how strong of a presence the African-American community have in Ghana. On the weekends, visiting the beaches of Accra, especially Kokobite, there is a huge African-American presence which goes to show the social circle one would have still should in case you grace Ghana with your presence. The last point, the currency is. In Ghana, most popular places could also charge in US dollars, which is just a plus, but that's the case. While weighing the value of any purchase to the standards your money holds, transacting purchases of either goods and services is super easy in Ghana, since even if you are stranded with not enough CDs, depending on the area in Accra that you find yourself, you could still go on without any hassle whatsoever and several Airbnbs and apartments in Ghana also charge in dollars, making some aspects quite easy and more familiar to you. And this point is just a plus and doesn't work everywhere, but it's something to have in mind. So whenever you think of visiting an African country, I would strongly recommend the motherland Ghana as it's fantastic irrespective of the fact that some other African countries are equally as awesome. Be sure to like and subscribe to this channel to show your approval of this video and also for more content like this. Be sure to check out this video next as it pertains to awesome creative and innovative buildings in Ghana. Thank you and on to the next video. Be sure to check this video out.